Spoken Memorials is a public service of Lemonster Television, sponsored by the Lemonster Telecommunications Corporation, Incorporated. The following are passings taken from the Lemonster Champion. Dennis Chet Barron, 73, formerly of Lemonster, passed away July 5, 2018. His memorial mass will be celebrated July 13th at St. Mary's Church in New York. Arrangements were under the care of the Johnson Kennedy Funeral Home. Andrew S. Cochran, 29, formerly of Lemonster, passed away June 30th, 2018 in his home in Fitchburg. Calling hours were held July 5th. Burial was private. Arrangements were under the care of the Silas F. Richardson and Son Funeral Home. Rosemary M. Lozier Connery, 70, of Lemonster, passed away June 29, 2018 at UMass Hospital in Worcester after a long illness. The funeral service will be held July 14 at 1 p.m. at the Silas F. Richardson and Son Funeral Home. A calling hour will be held prior to the service from noon to 1 p.m. in the funeral home. Richard A. DeMar, 63, formerly of Lemonster, passed away July 2nd, 2018. A visitation and a prayer were held July 8th. Arrangements were under the care of the Brandon Funeral Home in Fitchburg. Lorraine D. Smith Dorrance, 78, of Lemonster, passed away June 30th, 2018 in Rose Monahan Hospice House in Worcester after an illness. Burial took place July 6th in the Massachusetts Veterans Memorial Cemetery in Winchenden. Arrangements were under the care of the Wright Roy Funeral Home. Marianne O'Keefe Nelson, 85, formerly of Lemonster, passed away July 3, 2018 at Sterling Village. A private committal service was held at the Massachusetts Veterans Memorial Cemetery in Winchenden. Arrangements were under the care of the Miles Sterling Funeral and Tribute Center in Sterling. Timothy Nettos, 90, of Lemonster, passed away July 5, 2018, at the Life Care Center of Lemonster. A memorial service will be held July 14 at 1.30 p.m. in the Kingdom Hall of Jehovah's Witnesses on Central Street in Lemonster. Arrangements are under the care of the Silas F. Richardson & Son Funeral Home. Joan Wesley Pilon, 84, of Lemonster, passed away June 30th, 2018 in Keystone Center in Lemonster. A memorial service will be held at a later date. Arrangements are under the care of the Wright Roy Funeral Home. Awireda Zazu, 50, of Lemonster, passed away June 30th, 2018. Funeral services will be held July 28th at 9 a.m. in the Wright Roy Funeral Home. Burial will follow in Evergreen Cemetery. Calling hours are July 27th from 6 to 8 p.m. in the Funeral Home. Richard F. Warner, 71, of Lemonster, passed away June 29th, 2018 at home after a brief illness. Calling hours were held July 6th. Burial was private. Arrangements were under the care of the Silas F. Richardson and Son Funeral Home. Paula Elaine Brammer, age 58, of Maryland, passed away peacefully on July 3, 2018. Born on November 11, 1959 in Fitchburg, Massachusetts, she was the daughter of the late Paul Ernest and Marie Louise Quinlan Prue. Paula worked for many years as a medical billing specialist for the Delaware Center for Digestive Care, where she was always adored by her co-workers. She was a lover of horses, swimming, ballet, roller skating, and the Girl Scouts of America. Paula was an avid reader, specifically of Stephen King books. She also greatly enjoyed traveling, especially going on cruises, where she loved drinking mudslides. 
Paula is survived by her son, Timothy Brammer of Parkville, Maryland, sister Mary Lou Varville of Conowingo, Maryland, brother Martin Prue of Lemonster, and several nieces, nephews, and cousins. A going away party in Paula's honor was held on Saturday, July 7th at R.T. Ford Funeral Home in Pennsylvania. Memorial contributions may be made payable to Days End Farm Horse Rescue or Kaufman Cancer Center and Sent in Care of the Funeral Home, P.O. Box 248, Rising Sun, Maryland, 21911. To send online condolences, please visit their website, www.rtford.com. May they rest in peace. This is Jasmine Loft, and you've been listening to Spoken Memorials, sponsored by the Lemonster Telecommunications Corporation, Incorporated.